I'm Gabby with Cooking with the Cullinans, and today we are going to make these really easy um, air fryer chicken nuggets. Just super easy, delicious. I hope it helps you out on a busy day. Okay, so, you know, I got that Christmas music going. Got a little Christmas decorating going on here, too. So, today, I'm going to make these homemade chicken nuggets in the air fryer because i don't know about you but this time of year it's crazy out there there's so much going on there's so many different places everyone in your family needs to go you just need a really quick good fast meal well this is it so i've got a couple chicken breasts here i got a pair of kitchen shears because i use these whenever i can instead of a knife a little salt and pepper a little mayonnaise, a little garlic powder, because you know I like some garlic, and some panko breadcrumbs. Okay, so you can see that I have cut up the chicken. I got my little pile of chicken fat and all that over there. And I've just made them kind of small, medium-sized chunks. And, you know, the great part about this is if you have a whole bunch of people to feed, then cut up three or four or five or six, however many chicken breasts you want. If you just have a couple, you can just cut up enough for that couple of people. This is where this recipe gets absolutely simple easy. The next thing I do is I take some mayonnaise and I'm just gonna use this squeeze bottle because it's easier for the video, but you could certainly use a couple of spoons of mayonnaise. I'm gonna go ahead and put the salt and the pepper right in the bag, right on the mayonnaise, because I have found if you try to put it in the breadcrumbs, it just all goes to the bottom and that goodness doesn't get all over the chicken. All right, I'm just gonna smush this around in the bag a little bit before we get started. And again, if you're doing a lot of chicken, you're gonna need more mayonnaise. If you're not, you won't. And then I'm just gonna throw all this chicken right in the bag. And aside from the Christmas music in the background, you can literally make this recipe anytime. I just think it's a really great one for how crazy and busy life can be around the holidays. My light went out like I've said before guess I'm bright enough without it all right so then now this is what that chicken is looking like I'm just gonna put it back on here so you can actually see it and see how each little piece has all that mayonnaise and goodness on it throw my little scraps right in this bag because we can just throw that away then you can either get out another Ziploc bag, throw some panko crumbs in there, or you can do it on a plate. Okay, so here we go. We have the panko breadcrumbs in a Ziploc bag. I'm gonna add all that chicken that has the mayonnaise and all of the spices coated over it right into this Ziploc bag. As I said, you could actually use a plate if you wanted to. You could use a reusable bag if you feel bad about using all the throw disposable bags. Or you could even wash and clean out the Ziploc bag. All right, we're gonna need a little more, some more breadcrumbs in there. By the way, I had to stop and make myself a cup of coffee. I was just running out of a little bit of steam. All right, so once we get these all good and coated with the breadcrumbs, I told you this was easy, y'all. <clears throat> then we're gonna go ahead and put them in the air fryer and we're gonna cook them in the air fryer at 400 degrees for about seven to 10 minutes. Of course, it's gonna depend on how big you make the chunks. 
I make them kind of medium to small. If I need them to cook even faster, I just make a bunch of small ones and in about five to six minutes, they'll be done. See you when they're done. Okay, so these chicken nuggets have been in the air fryer for seven minutes. I did flip them over about half of the way through. And so this is what they look like. They are super tender and juicy. Gotta have a little dipping sauce. I got a little honey mustard and a little creamy buffalo here. Mm -mm -mm. Crispy, juicy, quick, easy. If you are liking the recipes that we do or that I do and it's making your life a little bit easier, please subscribe to our channel. Give me a like. Please drop in the comments if you'd like to see some other kind of recipe, any, any comment. I'll get back to you. I hope you enjoy. Have an awesome day.